finally, let's talk about how on your resume or curriculum vita that you would make a notation that you serve as a manuscript reviewer. First of all, for a blinded review process, you would never on your CV or your resume list the name of the article that you reviewed. Remember, it's a blinded process. The author is never to know who you were. So even once the paper is published, you as the reviewer remain blinded. So on your resume or your curriculum vita, do not list the titles of the papers you have reviewed. Instead, you can make a listing of the name of the journal for which you have served as a reviewer. You could say, for instance, that in the year 2014, you reviewed four papers for a particular journal. So that's how the citation would be done, but never, never do you list the actual name of the paper or the name of the author. So I hope after going through this module that you feel more confident in your ability to be a reviewer. I hope you will contact journal editors and volunteer to be a reviewer. It's a wonderful process and reviewers are very much needed by all of our journals. So I hope this module helps you do an excellent review, but remember, the editor wants to tap into your content expertise. Resist the urge to correct merely spelling, grammar, punctuation, and style of references. Instead, give the editor and the author the content expertise that you have. Give them your honest critique to help them improve their paper.